This is a used food barrel that I got from a food distributor. It's plastic, 55 gallons, and was used to ship olives. This style of barrel has a two-piece lid. A ring. And a bowl. Using a spade bit of any size, drill a number of holes in the lid. When you're finished drilling the lid, put some window screen over the top. This will filter out the debris from the downspout and it will keep mosquitoes out as well. Tighten the ring down onto the screen to hold it tight. Next, using a three-quarter inch spade bit, drill a hole for the faucet. Using a half inch sediment faucet, thread it into the barrel wall. No tape or silicone is needed because this is a pipe thread and it actually widens as it screws in. So that'll cut right into the barrel wall and create a tight seal. If you had to repair it in some way, you could use tape or silicone. But as long as you don't over tighten it, that'll create a tight seal. Finally is the overflow. Take a one inch spade bit and drill a hole for the overflow fitting. You can use a lot of different items for an overflow. This is just the one that I like. It's actually an irrigation fitting. It's got a one inch di outside diameter on it and a garden hose fitting. I'm going to need a crescent wrench to do that up. It's not necessary for this to be watertight since it's just the overflow anyway. The idea with this is to put about six to eight feet of garden hose on it with some window screen on the end so it can divert the excess water away from the barrel. There may be instances where that overflow won't evacuate enough water coming in from the downspout and you'll have to watch for that and adjust accordingly.